Hi, today I'm going to show you how to RDP into your Raspberry Pi from a Windows laptop or desktop computer. And I'm on my Windows machine right now. And I go to this website. I will post this in the uh, description below so you can get to the website. And I just downloaded this file here, the Portable Edition didn't want to install it on my computer or anything so I downloaded it, I created a, a folder inside my downloads and I downloaded it right here now I go in here and I'll unzip it, which I already have unzipped it and go to extract to and right there it'll that folder was good enough for me so I extracted it and here it is right here so I come in here and now I do the personal exe. Start this up. Okay. And here's what you'll see when that starts up. Now I've already set up uh, RDP on my Raspberry Pi. But as soon as we log in, I'll show you how I did that. So first, you're going to go to Sessions. You're going to go to RDP. And here, you're going to type in the IP address of your Raspberry Pi. And if you don't know that, I'll show you how to do that once we get in the Raspberry Pi. And the username for the Raspberry Pi will just be Pi. And if you're asked for a password, the password is Raspberry. Pretty simple. And then you just click OK. And it will create you a new RDP session. So I click on mine. I already added in my IP address. Mine was 192.168.0.21. So now I'm, I'm into my Raspberry Pi now. Here we see it. I'll go full screen. And fit to window size okay so I'm logged into my Raspberry Pi now it's that easy on the Windows side download it start it up uh, go to RDP put in the IP address username and then you can connect now how did I connect here on my Raspberry Pi well first I had to this is a fresh install of Raspbian on my Raspberry Pi. I've done nothing to it except I installed this RDP program here. So you type in sudo apt get install xrdp. You hit enter or return. That will install the RDP and start it up. And okay after you do that then you're going to want to get the IP address so you can log in from your Windows mach machine so you're going to type in IP address and show and here you go you got your WLAN 0 and your IP address is right here you got 192.168.0.21 and that's what I put in my Windows machine to connect and I think when you go to connect it might ask you for that password like I said and if it does it's Raspberry thanks for watching please like subscribe comment below if you have any comments thanks bye